More than two dozen people reported compromised information from ATM skimmers in Santa Barbara, prompting a warning from law enforcement. Remain vigilant when visiting the ATM. KSBY News supporter Delaney White got some advice from officers. Delaney? Law enforcement officials tell me this problem has been going on for a long time, but the technology they use has changed and evolved over the years, making their job much more difficult. Scammers are going up and down the coast of California using non-detectable skimming devices to obtain banking information. These devices are easy to install in ATM machines and Bank of America ATMs in the Santa Barbara area have been heavily targeted. There's been uh, over two dozen reported cases of these um, skimming devices being installed. The skimming devices are small and usually are hidden in the card reader with a hidden camera that records the user typing in the PIN number. Scammers can then clone the debit card and withdraw as much money as the ATM will allow from any of the user's accounts. The affected Bank of America ATMs in Santa Barbara didn't have any counter skimming devices. Bank of America is also the primary manager for all of the Employment Development Department accounts, making them a prime target. Those California Employment Development Department cards um, do not have that security chip. Sergeant Ragsdale says they are primarily seeing cards without the embedded gold chip being affected because the skimming devices collect the account number from the magnetic strip on the back of the card. Eric Vitali has been investigating skimming operations since 2010 and says the operations are generally conducted by organized crime groups who are not from this area. They usually travel through a city, often just staying for the weekend while they collect banking information and then move on. Generally, they will do it on a Thursday night or a Friday night for the weekend. That's when they usually see the most activity. Law enforcement officials say the best way to keep your information safe at an ATM like this one is to check the keypad and the card reader to make sure any skimming devices haven't been attached. If, it is, if it's raised up about a quarter of an inch, try pulling it off. If it comes off, it's a skimmer. Vitaly says the safest way to transfer funds is through e-commerce using apps like Apple Pay or Venmo. Ragsdale says it's best to go into a bank and speak to a teller if you need to withdraw money. But if you absolutely have to use an ATM, just make sure to try to cover up that PIN number as you're entering it. Nina, Richard, back to you. Delaney, do the officers tell you anything else on how people can ensure their bar banking information isn't compromised? Yeah, they said to check the card reader and the pin pad to make sure nothing has been attached to it like a skimming device. Also to check for hidden cameras in the area and again to cover up that pin number as you're entering it. Good. Reporting live in San Luis Obispo, Delaney White, KSBY News. And good information there, Delaney. Thank you.